Welcome to the voice of the Lord. Our verse for today is in Ecclesiastes chapter 10 verse 3. Even as he walks along the road, the fool lacks sense and shows everyone how stupid he is. Have you seen the fools walking on the road? Friends, they lack no sense. They continue to display their foolishness. They brag about their wickedness. Friends, you would know them just by looking at them. You would know them by the way that they live their lives. When they open their mouth, you would know because they display their stupidity. They show everyone how stupid they are. Friends, those are the fools. But how about you? Are you a fool? Well, walk in righteousness. Brag about your faith if you get to brag, friends. Not bragging about wickedness. That's why the Apostle Paul was even saying that if I get to boast, I boast in the Lord. Amen. I talk about what He had done in me. I talk about the things that had changed in my life. Not about the foolish things that I do and continue to do. No. That is the work of the stupid or the fools. So friends, today, let us learn from this. Amen. People are watching us. Remember, friends, that we are the epistles, the letters of the Lord. People are reading the message of the Lord in us. They look at us. They look at the way that we live our lives. And they will see that the God that we are serving is a faithful God. If God can change us, friends, they would believe that they too can be changed the way that we are changed. And therefore, let us be conscious in the way that we live our lives. Let us not be fools walking on the road, bragging about their wickedness and showing everyone their stupidity. Amen. Rather, let us walk in faith and show everyone how good the Lord has been to us. Amen. Let's go and testify about the goodness and the grace of God. Then, friends, they will be won over into the kingdom of God. But the, the stupid friends, the fools, who would want to follow in their footsteps? Nobody. But let them follow in our footsteps as we demonstrate our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. Let us be a living example of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So friends, again, this is our joy as believers. We can testify of the goodness of God daily, wherever we are, at work, at home, in the marketplace, wherever we are, friends, people are watching, people are dealing with us, and may they glorify God through in us because of what they are or what the Lord is doing in us. Amen. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May He lift up His countenance on you and give you peace. God bless. See you next time.